Hey everyone, welcome back to Bit9, your go-to channel for tech tips and tricks. Today we're tackling a common issue, how to clear system data storage on your Mac. Let's free up space and keep your Mac running smoothly. Let's dive right in. To check how much space system data is using, click on the Apple menu in the top left corner and select System Settings. Next, go to the General tab and click on Storage. Here you'll see a breakdown of your Mac storage. Scroll down to find system data. This includes system logs, temporary files, cache files, and other data Mac OS needs to operate. While some of it is essential, a lot of it can be safely removed. Now let's clear your cache files. Cache files are temporary data created by apps in the system. While helpful in speeding up processes, they can accumulate over time, slowing your Mac and even harboring malware. To clear them, open Finder and press Command plus Shift plus G. In the search bar, type forward slash library caches to access system-wide cache files. Delete folders you no longer need. If you see a warning like, the operation can't be completed because you don't have permission to access some of the items, just leave those folders alone. Next, repeat the process. Press Command plus Shift plus G again, and this time type tilde library caches to access user-specific cache files. Remove any unnecessary folders here as well. Let's move on to clearing log files. Logs record system and app activities, but often pile up without serving any purpose. In Finder, press Command plus Shift plus G, and type tilde library logs to access user-specific logs. Delete any unneeded files. Then repeat the process by typing forward slash library forward slash logs to access system logs. Again, remove unnecessary files here. After clearing cache and log files, restart your Mac. This ensures any lingering temporary files are flushed out. Next, empty the trash to permanently delete all the removed files. Lastly, let's use macOS's built-in tools. Open System Settings. Go back to Storage. Use the recommendations like Optimize Storage, Empty Trash Automatically, or Reduce Clutter to remove unnecessary files. And there you have it. By following these steps, you've cleared system data storage and optimized your Mac's performance. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like, subscribe to the channel, and share it with your friends. Thanks for watching, and see you in the next one.